With years of testing and refinement, the Farm King 4480 large square bale carrier is simple to operate with an intuitive display. In this video, we will cover all the tractor requirements and the physical setup of the 4480 large square bale carrier. Starting with the tractor, it must have a minimum of 100 horsepower and weigh at least 25,000 pounds. Hydraulic requirements for the carrier would be a minimum of 20 gallons per minute and 2,500 PSI. The electrical system for the tractor must be 12 volts for the carrier to properly operate. The power harness does include a three-prong auxiliary power connection. If your tractor does not have this available, an additional harness is available for purchase for direct battery power. The power jumper harness must be run directly to the battery of the tractor. Once it is properly run to the rear of the tractor and secured, connect it to the carrier harness. Once the cab harness has been run from the cab of the tractor back to the carrier, it is time to connect it to the carrier harness. The 4480 bale carrier comes standard with a trailer light package. Connect it at this time. The 4480 carrier requires one set of hydraulic connections. Be sure to identify the pressure and return lines to ensure proper hydraulic flow. Moving into the cab, find a suitable place to mount the display. Preferably mount it somewhere stable and back to the right of the operator for quick accessibility. Connect the cab harness to the power accessory port in the cab. Connect the cab harness to the rear of the monitor. Connect the cab harness to the control handle. Prior to operation, thoroughly read and understand your owner's manual. 